Gentlemen, welcome along to another customer review from us. This time, as you may be able to tell, it is all about the Crown Big X 880 self propelled forager. And to tell us what he thinks of the machine and how he's been getting on with it, we have Mr. Freddy Shanahan. He's here. He's loving it already. I mean, this is a bloke who's enjoying life. He's got a massive grin on his face, oh, right? so it's all good. So, Freddie, I mean, just before we kick off and uh, delve into the forager and find out what you think of it, I mean, first of all, just tell us a little bit about the, uh, the contractor that you work for, uh, David Fox Contracting. Yeah, I work with David Fox, uh, been with him uh, 22 years, and uh, yeah, I'm a chopper driver. That's it? An, That's happy, it. an happy chopper driver? Happy chopper driver. That's my world, yeah. That's it. And what sort of area would you guys cover with your contracting outfit? We have another class for it, yeah. Um, we, do, uh, we, do, we do a few thousand acres, mate, so between the both of us. And what sort of other services do you do, you do as well? For oh my god, we do everything. Tankering, muck spreading, we combine in, you name it, we do it. That's it. Anything. So, whereabouts in the world are we today? Well, actually, tell us whereabouts you guys are based. Uh, we we are found out in Messingham, uh, North Lincolnshire. And for the contracting side, how far would you sort of travel to go to jobs? What's your sort of working area? To um, Kermington. That's mainly where I am based, shopping. The other chopper is based around Hibblesdale. Right. And whereabouts are we today then? We yeah, have not been here before, we're at King of Bees. Right. Yeah. But it looks like a fairly decent crop of bees over here. Yeah, it's not bad here, a bit rough. Hold on. <laughs> not too bad. I've seen a lot worse, trust me. Oh my god. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Jesus! <Jeez, laughs> they get these trailer drives, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> so obviously we're in, uh, we're in a crop of maize today. Do you, do you do any other sort of chopping? Do you chop from grass? Do you do yeah. all the crop? Yeah, yeah, yeah do, uh, do right and uh, quite a bit of grass. We do three cuts of grass a year, but obviously with the drought, we've only done two cuts. So yeah, on to the forager then, which yeah. is obviously the big X880. Yeah. Um, roughly how many hours from this one? Uh, just over 800. Right, so you've got a few to play with then. Yeah, yeah. Right. So how long have you been running this forager then? This season, I've got it, got it for pays. I demoed a 780 uh, for grass um, until I got this one, so yeah. Right, so that was this year when you demoed the 780? Yeah, it is, And then yeah. you got this 880 this for, for the base for the, main, for the yeah. base season? Yeah. Right, got you. And did this forager, when you got it, did it replace any other? particular machine? Or yeah, it replaced uh, my old class 970. Right. Which I've had a few years. Yeah. And would that have been a, that'd have been a V8 970 that one? Yeah. It? Yeah. Oh yeah. So you got another V8 in this one? Oh yeah. Yeah. That's it. And how does this one compare to your, well let's just say your previous machine that you were running? Yeah. I'm still bonding with it, you know. Um, it has its perks, I do miss a couple of bits on the class, I'm not slating the public class forager because I've, I've, been, I've been on the class forager for nearly 10 years, so right. I mean, this is just a totally different jump now. And the maze that we're chopping today, is this going for AD or what's... Yeah, 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 this is going to AD, yeah. Right. So having lived with the uh, the Chrome for a little bit this maze season, um, what would you say the sort of standout features that you really like you with this forager. The header, I think uh, this this year with the header the mains being short uh, is coat really well. Yeah. All around the head of this and it's light. Yeah. Now to it. And how many rolls is this one? This is a 12 row. Right. Like but with if I well okay 12 row was in if it was if it was standard space standard and like space, 70, yeah. 750 mm yeah. bit cold roll but um, visibility I think it's I think it is a quieter cab yeah I'm getting younger younger bit it's uh, it's comfortable and for guidance you're not going off the tentacles no. tentacles yeah tentacles now I've got my trim ball 
So I can go whatever angle I want to go. I can yeah. head off and follow it. That's it, with this being such a narrow roll space as well. Yeah. And when you were sort of going from your previous forages to this one, obviously you went for an 880, which I think is the biggest V8 that we are all do. Yeah. They had to do a work, they had to do a work. Yeah. Was this... I'm going to say, what, what sort of bit you go for this sort of size, this model? No, it's just what, that's all we need. Yeah. It's, it, it's just something we're allowing to do. Yeah. I do, I'm doing hellish more acreage. But is it good? Is it one of them years that the crops are brilliant? But like look at me now, you know, I'm steady enough in here. Yeah. This is this is doing well. That's it. I see you just cruising away too, it was about five, five mile an hour, something like that. Yeah. Easy doing, you know, I can no no problem doing on today a day, you know, I've done a I've done a 140 acre. I'm putting what am I doing like 1400, 1600 tons in clamps a day, 13,000. As long as I've got my trailers to keep me going, yeah, keep jumping them. So that's 1700 revenue Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm at 100, 100 uh, engine load, so yeah. That's, keep... that, that's what it is. That's its up to me. That's what it looks like. Just wants. So, what's engine characteristics like? Does it sort of hang on or.? Uh, yeah, it sometimes it, it knows, it knows it sometimes. But that's one thing I've got to change myself from the class. I know its limits. But when you when you do start to get near that, you know, the engine yeah. limit, the engine Woo! load, yeah, just to uh, pull it back a little bit. Yeah. Does it? Is it a gentle drop off when you start to get to limit, or is it like going to a cliff and it just falls off? Nah, you can just just steady, steady, steady. You know? Yeah. Oh, it gives you lots of warning. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And then. Obviously, forward speed control. It's a little bit different to the to your previous machine. Obviously, you're nudging it here and there. How's that sort of compare? How do you get on with that? <laughs> well, as I say, it's, as I say, it's like driving a fender. And I'm not a fender. It's a simple sort of setup. Yeah. Um, on a on a nice long field, I'd have cruise control on, but these short these short rounds. Yeah, that's it. She's nimble for a bit, but that's not shit. Oh, the turning circle in it. That's another thing, turning circle, that's... I can soon wipe a trailer out. <laughs> when, I, when I first got it, Jesus, it turns ever so sharp. Yeah. Yeah, yeah brilliant. And does have it the, the rear suspension help at all? Yeah, yeah. Oh, down the road, um, ever so good. Yeah, yeah. not get me. Get a bit of a... Help Gary, it's not that I do um, got a little bit of a nodding donkey on my class a little bit. Yeah. Um, this. No. Yeah. It's one of them because it's like with it being at the back, you wouldn't think it'd make that much difference, but no. clearly it must do. Yeah, this curved windscreen, that's visibility, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's good. All round wipers. Can we see how many you got? Three on there, have you? Yeah, all the way around. Yeah. Um, yeah. Loads of room. Yeah. yeah. We've got pedals as well, so I can put your feet to them. No, that, they're actually for somewhere. I fold my head up for them. Oh, right. Wow. They do something. Yes, yeah, so I can plant my phone while I'm yeah. holding up. Right? Yeah. Got you. And controls and layout, what were we, what were we thinking? Obviously, I've got buttons on here that I can I can have whatever I want on them. Yeah. Um, and it's all to do with the operator. I can change everything, you know, to suit who's driving it. You know. And screen-wise, there. Yeah, obviously I have. That's uh, my dials there. Like, but I, I, you know, I've got a little reversing camera, so I can I can see what 
he's happening behind me once I've chopped it in case I've got a bit of a laid maze or the trailer's up my ass so I can see how close he is. Yeah, that's it. And so sort of like navigation of that screen, what's that like? Just sort of, is it fairly simple to sort of get your head around and yeah, no, find I, things? I put, and I put everything on, I can put anything I want down this bottom, you know, engine. I can just, I can change everything to how I want it. So, practicality wise, um, I mean, sort of starting at the front, what sort of like fitting headers like, getting them on and off? Uh, piece of this. That good? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. You just... Um, that round part of the front. Yeah, that big ring. It's up, it's on. Yeah. That's it, you're away. See, the, uh, I mean, the whole crop header, I don't have to get out of the cab. I just, I've got my, uh, my buttons in here to lock it in, lock it off. Yeah. And that's it. Lift it off the trailer, off I go. You know, it's just like that. Like, like you don't even have to get out and couple anything up or anything, do you? No, only the, only the, obviously the whole crop I do. Yeah. And in terms of like daily maintenance, things like that, or even, you know, bigger maintenance jobs, what's it like sort of getting out the chopping cylinder for checks and things like that, or even when you are changing your knives? I have, um, well, obviously I'm still new to all that, I'm learning. Um, I am probably having JPM to do all that. Yeah. Um, general greasing. Um, there's the odd grease nipple, but mainly I've got, you know, keep the auto loom full. Yeah. That is a must. And can you see the nerves at all while the feed rollers are in place? You know, just for a quick look in the morning? Yeah, yeah. I have a little curtain, stop a lot of trash blowing in. Bomb cracker, wow, how oh, that drops down. Yeah. Yeah. Just winding handle drops straight onto three three little wheels, straight onto the deck and onto the floor and just wheel down. And from that point of view, would you say like crawls would back and thought into you know, just you know the maintenance and the access and things like that? Yeah, definitely, yeah. This has lights everywhere, even a light where the stone, um, uh, sharpening stone is, the light there, you know, just stuff the phone. Yeah. Just everywhere. Just a little detail. Yeah. yeah. And in terms of, like, onboard storage for spares and tools and things like that, is there much space on this forager? Yeah. Yeah, obviously, that's the right hand side, back to box, this is the left hand side, to the box. I carry, I carry a few odd sockets, spanners, anything major that is JPM. Yeah. <laughs> and they're, you know, they're straight away the wrong way back. So. I was going to say, what's uh, dealer backup being right? Because it's yeah. JPM Agri, is it? JPM Agriculture? Yeah, it is, yeah. Yeah, yeah obviously, we're new with them. Just like they do with us. So. And how's that relationship working out? Yeah, good. James is uh, James is spot on. Gets it, gets me uh, mended them off the door again. Not saying I've been broken down a lot, but just you know, brand new machine, couple of little niggly things, but nothing major. Yeah. So you've been running this for the for the base season so far. Is there anything that you found on it that you might like to change at all? Or if you could have anything different? If you had a wish list? Yeah, I don't like the steering button where it is. I want to swap them buttons. <laughs> um, I want, yeah, the fridge in big enough, so I don't use it because, you know, I've got, you know, I've got a couple of cans in it. Yeah, it's about it, just the essentials. Yeah. It, yeah. Still waiting for my hoodie. Still waiting for the hoodie. There you go. Crawl, if you're watching. Jamie! Yeah, this man wants his hoodie. <laughs> Otherwise, you won't be uh, having another crawl. <laughs> <laughs> so, go on then, right, sum up then. Overall, first impressions of running a crawl big X. The maze balls. Enough said. <laughs> But so far, so good, would you say? Yeah. Yeah, I've got... Uh, yeah, I'm down to me. They've done well to, to get it how it is. 
Yeah. Well, that's it because I, you know, this market at the moment it's some tough competition, so it's going to really, oh, it's got to hold yeah. its own, hasn't it? Yeah. yeah. So is that on gang, isn't it? Adam? Is that on gang, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. something like triple, yeah. Right. So you mapped it out on that first time around yeah. and then you're just following that? Yeah. Well, that's it. Yeah, so that'd be a border with that dotted line, is it? That? Yeah, it yeah. is, yeah. 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 Oh, I see. Oh. There you go. Oh, yeah, they're just not pretty face, you know. Oh, I can suss this. Oh, you've got some technology there, yeah. haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> is that something that JPM fits with that? Or is yeah, they yeah. put it in. I had that in my 970 the last couple of seasons. Yeah. Um, but yeah, yeah it's, it's all steering ready. That's pretty much that's the new that's the new screen coming in, here, plugged in, off a go. Simple as that? Yeah. yeah. Maybe you'll be able to use that for your whole crop and everything else. Oh yeah. use it, yeah, yeah, use it, it'll be able to put in. Oh! oh. 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 Well the little bugger. Yeah. Little thing, yeah. Oh well, well he's unbugging that. Not unbugging, he's not unbugging. No, the metal detector's gone off. Metal detector, yeah, look, look, camera. Yeah, look, metal detector's yeah. gone off, alright. So while he's fishing around yeah. in there, I'll sign off, shall I? Right. Oh my god, you won't be able to sign off. I've got to sign off everything. You've yeah. got something silly crazy. Yeah, yeah, I've got some shit to do. Uh, right, so, Freddy, thank you very much for your time. It's been spot on that, getting, yeah. your, getting your thoughts on, the, on your Chrome Big X. Yeah, I'll just have a bit of light. A bit of light, yeah. So yeah, thanks for your very much for your time. And uh, yeah. spot on as that. And yeah. that's it. Thank you guys for watching as well. Uh, for loads more reviews and customer reviews, head over to that lampowertv.com. <laughs> and uh, we'll catch you again next time. Bye! I'll be right now. Oh, I'm ready. So I feel like something you say